Hello everybody, this is your boy Drew GZ and I am back once again with, you guessed it, another Power Ranger Lightning Collection video. Today, as you guys can see, I am doing SPD A Squad Green. If you guys have not seen my SPD A Squad Red video, please check that video out. I greatly appreciate it. My first time viewers, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that bell for all post notifications. Please hit the thumbs up. Please leave a comment. I greatly appreciate it. It goes a long way in the YouTube algorithms. Nevertheless, we are here to talking about today the SPD A Squad Green Ranger. If you guys watch SPD, you guys know there was an A Squad and a B Squad. Of course, you guys know this a backstory again, real quick. Just in case people didn't know, the A Squad, you know, you first seen them in the episode, they went on a mission to go get uh, Kruger. I mean, I forgot the guys, I forgot the villain's name, so don't, don't, don't kill me on the comments. I forgot his name. They went after him. Um, never came back to the end of the series when they portrayed SPD B Squad. SPD B Squad had to fight them, and of course, they ended up beating them in the end, and you know how it goes. But anyway, nevertheless, this is the SPD A Squad Green Ranger. Of course, you guys know Hasbro do great box artworks. So shout out to Hasbro again for the great box artwork. This was the last figure I needed to complete the A Squad. So you guys know as collectors, when you get a team, like Power Ranger collectors in particular, when you get the team, the whole team together, it just looks, it just looks awesome. So I am going to, you know, give you guys some uh, pictures and stuff like that. Check me out on my Instagram, Jujitsu Collectibles. Uh, my Facebook, Jujitsu Collectibles. I have a bunch of pictures of uh, SPD V Squad with Doggy Kruger, the Mega Ranger, of course, all the A Squad. Uh, but nevertheless... First, take a look at the box. You got the SPD A Squad Ranger on the side. As it turns to the back, you got the pose for the A, for the A Squad. Pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? All of them look the same, you guys. Like I say, it's not nothing you haven't seen in the last four videos, all the A Squad. As it turns to the side, again, you got the SPD green wrapped around the box from the side to the front. It says SPD A Squad Ranger. The Ranger's in the box as well. But enough about this box, man. We're gonna take this box, take this figure out the box, take the accessories out the books. Out the box, sorry, out the box. And we're gonna take a closer look at the details. All right, you guys, as you can see, I've taken everything out of the box. The first thing I'm gonna take a look at is the accessories. As you guys know, just like all the other SPD A squad, they weapons are pretty much the same. Assault rifle, lightning effect, two poseable hands. It's nothing new, you guys. I'm sorry that they didn't like do nothing new or change anything, but this is how they look in the show. So they have to replica, replicate what they look like in the show. But nonetheless, you got these two closed fist posable hands. You guys know I don't plan on using them. I, I really hate them, but they have to put them with the figure just in case people like posable hands. I really don't. So I don't plan on using them, but they have them in here. Then next, you got the lighting effect. Um, once again, recycled lighting effects. It is green. So once again, that's a plus. Uh, but other than that, that's pretty much it, guys. It's just blah. And then we have the assault rifle. You guys know, like in my last my last videos with any SPD A squad, they have the green because it matches the green SPD A squad ranger. All the rifles are the colors and they coordinate with the rangers themselves. So, um, like I say, nothing to really talk about. The SPD symbol here, as you symbol here, you got the green here, green here. Just know that's the green ranger's rifle. But other than that, like I say, there's nothing. I don't see too spectacular about the accessories when it comes to the SPD A Squad Green Ranger. What you see is what you get, man. So you guys know it's collectors. Sometimes they be like, oh, we keep getting the same stuff. But this is the way the episode and the series was made. So we have to oblige by what they did. But that's it for the accessories. We're going to take a closer look at the Green Ranger SPD A Squad and check them out. All right, you guys, you can see I have SPD A Squad Green Ranger out of the box. First impressions, like I say, he looks like the other A Squad members. It looks good. They recycled the Lost of Space helmet, added some extra little uh, features on it, gave him some type of little vest, like I want to say like football vest, shoulder pads, you know, bicep uh, protector, stuff like that. But nothing too fancy. As I bring him in for the closer view, you guys, as you can see, he looks just like the other SPD A Squad. So I'm gonna get the zoom in. Got the Doggy Kruger envelope on the front. SPD is what I should call it. I don't know why I keep saying Doggy Kruger, uh, but you got that. The You also have the Lost in Space green, which by the way, there was no green Lost in Space Ranger Dash. He just painted the helmet green to match the SPD squad, A squad. Uh, you got the double joint uh, elbow here. This is my first time opening this up, you guys. So I'm not, I wanna push it to the limit too much because it's my first time opening it, but I do recommend 
Everybody open up their finger at least once just to make sure everything works properly. Good arm extension. You guys can see, pretty good. Even the shoulder pads, a little nice and a little more plastic, a little flexible. Uh, not a lot of abdomen roll, and I think it's because of the shield or the protector, chest protector here. As you see, it's got the A's on the knees. You got the double joint right here in the leg. Great ankle, you know, articulation. Like I said, they build the guys a little bit more sturdier than the females, so um, you can be a little more rougher with the guys. Same thing on this side as well, you guys. Double joint being here in the knee. You do have a calf twist here. It does twist. Let me get a better view. It does twist. Of course, you got the ankle articulation here as well. Um, good split. Like I say, pretty good split for the guys for the most part. Uh, not going to complain. Uh, once again, double joint here. You got the SPD here on the arm. You got the forearm guard here. Once again, you got the good arm extension up and, and across. So like I say, man, it's the same thing as SPD pink, A squad, SPD blue, SPD red, SPD yellow. It's all the same. The whole figure is the same. Like I say, it's nothing too, it's nothing different about it. All it is different is just the color. That's the only thing that's different about it. Outside of that, that's pretty much it. Let me get it to focus. Focus now. There we go. Yeah, so that's pretty much it when it comes to SPD. A squad green, like you say, you guys, I've done 40s. You guys seen it already. So it's kind of like I'm recycling the same thing over and over again. But for people who want to see it still, I still do the reviews because you never know. Some people might have a favorite SPD A squad range. It could be red, it could be blue, it could be yellow. And maybe because it's their favorite color is why they like the SPD A squad as well as the B squad. But nevertheless, you guys, uh, my rating for the SPD B A squad green, um, you get a 10. I mean, I'm sorry, no, 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 not a 10. You get an 8. Cause like I say, it's just the same SPD A squad. They all look the same, you know. So that's the difference. At least with the heroes, they numbers change. They have different accessories, you know. For the most part, depending on what series you watch. But this series in particular, all of them have the same exact weapon. They just had the color coordinations to match. But like I say, you guys, I give it an eight out of ten. I'm gonna give you guys some great B-roll footage. I'll try the best that I can. Uh, yes, you guys see that I have the whole A squad, so you will see the whole A squad doing this B-roll footage, you, you guys, and thank you so much for watching this review. I really appreciate you guys. It's my first time watching this. Once again, you guys, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that bell for post notifications. Please give me a thumbs up. Please leave comments, whether it's good or bad. I really appreciate it. To my current subscribers, thank you guys for rocking with me. You guys have stuck with me, and I'm not going to do nothing keep going up. In the words of CJ on 32s, shout out to CJ on 32s. Shout out to Talk That Car Review. Shout out to I'm in Hellcat. Shout out to Life of Corey. Shout out to Mr. Organic, man. I watch them guys every day. And when they grind, I feel like I should be grinding. You know, it's like every day I should be doing something productive, whether it's working with a nine to five or coming home working on these videos for you guys to watch. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. It goes a long way. That's the end of this video, you guys. I'm going to give you my slogan. Give you some good B-roll footage. This is your boy, Jew Jeezy. Competition is always easy. You guys be safe. You guys be blessed. Until next time, you guys, I am out.